Lance Roberts here with three minutes on Markets and Money, talking a little bit about the value momentum rotation that's going on. Uh, interesting, though, today, Donald Trump talking about going after the Federal Reserve once again. Of course, what he's talking about here is the Fed needs to lower interest rates to zero or maybe even go negative so that we can refinance our debt long term at low interest rates. Well, it may sound good on the surface, but long term, it's a potential negative for the economy as if other interest rates around the world begin to rise, money will flow out of long dated low interest securities into other securities around the world that have a higher yield. So this potentially has long-term negative ramifications, even though in the short term, it may seem like the right thing to do. Not in all cases is running a government like running a business. And we have to think about things in terms of economic flows long-term. This also has part and parcel to do with this value momentum growth issue that's going on. Over the last few days, there's been a big shift between value stocks and the S&P 500. And we've seen the market hold up here recently very well. But if we take a look at what's happening, particularly with small cap and mid cap value stocks, there's been a dramatic surge in those prices. As you can see here, there's been a sharp uptick in the value section of small cap stocks. But again, this isn't really unusual. While there's a lot of excitement over this value uh, rotation that's going on currently, we've seen these type of spikes previously that have always failed because ultimately we come back to the real issue along with economic growth. And that has definitely been deteriorating over the course of the last several months in the economy. We can see the same thing with mid cap value as well. Once again, we see this big jump in prices of mid cap value. And again, that's been a much bigger move relative to the markets, and particularly compared to the S&P 500. This has been a big move. But again, not something that we haven't seen previously in this market. Each time previously, these moves have failed. So I'm not saying that this time isn't different and there's not an actual shift into value coming out of growth because value has been underperforming growth for quite a long time. And eventually there is going to be a rotation into those value shares out of highly overpriced momentum shares. But is this occurring now? Maybe. But it's too soon to tell if this is the trend that you want to buy into just yet because we are still within a negative trend overall within these markets. Pay attention to what's happening with the markets. Pay attention to what's happening with money flows. There are shifts that are occurring, but don't jump on that bandwagon too soon because as we've seen previously, those have turned out to be fairly quick disappointments. You know, make sure you're managing your money, appropriate risk, manage controls, and you always do better long term. I'm Lance Roberts with three minutes on your markets and money for today.